up everyone? Welcome back to the Coral Reef Talk. In today's episode, we're taking a look at the brand new Core X LED Reef Light by HM Electronics and Aquatic Life USA. back to the channel as you may know we are in the middle of the reef tank rebirth series now this series is all about me updating and upgrading things on the 210 gallon reef tank to make it better than before kind of revise it and bring it back to life now today we're talking about the brand new core x led reef light by hm electronics and aquatic life usa now aquatic life is known for making light fixtures as well as making the hybrid which combines t5 lighting and your favorite led light fixtures but now they have an led light fixture of their own that you can incorporate and use with your hybrid and it's the perfect marriage of t5s and leds so today i'm going to give you a run through of the light fixture itself and how i'm utilizing it over the 210 gallon reef now the light fixture itself is very slim and sleek in its design it's 14.3 inches by 7 inches i love the way it looks and it's got a solid build now the core x by aquatic life delivers vivid colors in the photosynthetic range that is perfect for growing corals now i've noticed in my tank in the few months that i've been using these lights over the 210 gallon reef that the toadstool leather corals are nice and puffy. Their polyps are out extended. The mushroom corals are responding better to the light and the anemones in the tank are really big and they're out and open and they're just soaking in this light. They're loving it. Now this light also utilizes a dual fan cooling system and it is IP66 waterproof and dust proof. Now it uses copper heat path technology, which conducts the heat a hundred times faster than your standard aluminum and it ensures that the fixtures are running cool. Now something I really like about the Core X is how you connect to the light fixture itself. You don't have to have any fancy networking background or use ethernet cables or your network or Wi-Fi to connect. It all connects using Bluetooth. So the first thing you want to do is go to your app store and you want to download the HM Aquamaster app this is the app that is going to allow you to control your new core x led lights now once the app opens it's going to ask to turn on bluetooth and, and you're going to have to hit yes because you need bluetooth to connect to your light fixtures now the first time you connect to the app it's going to ask you to put in a password the password you'll find inside the core x series booklet that you get inside the box with your core x light fixture now once you put in your password and your devices are connected it's going to ask you to enter a name now you can enter a custom name whatever you want for your light fixtures i'm just going to enter left reef light for one and right reef light for the other and once i have those in there this is how it shows up in your device list so you can see the left reef light and the right reef light and to connect to them all you have to do is tap each one and it's going to connect through Bluetooth and now they're connected. So to walk you through the app here, that's got some really neat functions to it. There is a lightning button if you want to add a lightning effect to your reef tank. It's really cool if you're entertaining guests or if you just wanna sit back and simulate some lightning over your reef. It's really cool to do. There's also a cloudy button that gives a nice cloud effect as it rolls over the top of your reef tank. It's a really nice natural effect that you can have clouds going over the top of your own slice of the ocean right there in your living room or wherever your tank may be. There's also a neon button. Now the neon button simulates a bunch of neon colors over your reef tank. So kind of like a party mode, you can check out some cool looking colors over your tanks. Now getting into the programming behind these light fixtures, the, it's very easy to do. There's some presets that you can follow. You can jump into these easy presets here and program based on areas around the world. You have things like 
Hawaii, the Caribbean Sea, the Mediterranean Sea, uh, Great Barrier Reef, which is what I have these lights programmed to as well. You can change those presets up, customize your own schedule for your reef tank, and you can save those out and share those as well. Now, another really cool feature to the app is that you can take a look at the spectrum itself. You can play around with the different colors and the wavelength. You can look at the relative power. You can see the spectrum of the lights, how they move and change with the different percentages. So you can change the color spe spectrum, move that around within the app, and you can see what the LED lights are actually doing. If we go back to the status tab, you can see my main schedule here. Now this is my schedule for the LED core lights, and you can see the temperature here down below. The temp is okay. The temperature is what the light fixtures are basically emitting, so your fans are turning on to keeping it cool. And you can see the temperature right now of my LED lights. So there's a quick look at the app. A lot of really cool things that you can do in there. I like that you can take a look at the spectrum. You can play around with the colors. I like the cool little effects that you have as well. And I like that you can program and set your schedule based on different areas from around the world. So you can kind of simulate those things above your reef tank. The Core X series has two different light fixtures. It has the Core X Compact and the Core X Pro, which is what I have above my tank. Now the Core X Compact has 26 LEDs and delivers up to 101 watts versus the Core X Pro, which has 48 LEDs and delivers up to 172 watts. Now when looking at these charts, you can see how the PAR stacks up between the Compact versus the Pro. The Core X Pro delivers more PAR so you can keep things like SPS corals. Maybe you have a mixed reef situation going on, but if you're not going that intense, then the Core X Compact is there for you. Now these light fixtures cover an area of 24 by 36. So that means if you have a tank that's 24 by 36, you only need one light fixture. In my case, however, I have a 72 inch long tank. So that's why I need two Core X Pros above the reef tank. Now when comparing the Core X Pro against other lights on the market, like uh, the Kessel AP700 or even a Radeon Gen 4, the Core X is more efficient with its energy usage. Uh, it's more uniform and higher output as far as PAR. And there's also no need to buy any additional equipment like a ReefLink. The Core X series lights are simple. You just plug them in, make sure your Bluetooth is on, download the app and you're good to go. They're durable, safe, and they're easy to use. So the question you may be asking now is how much do these things cost? You've given me all the information, the rundown on how to use the light. We took a look at the app as well. And so now you may be asking, well, how much do these Core X series light fixtures cost? Well, if you're looking at getting a Core X Pro, the price is going to be $499.99. And if you're looking for a Core X Compact, it's going to be $299.99. So 500 for the Pro and 300 for the Compact. As we all know, the reef tank hobby can be associated with high price and things can be expensive. And especially when looking at LED lights, the price is usually pretty high. Uh, but if you're looking compared to the other lights on the market, uh, these lights are priced in a good place, I believe. So 500 for the Pro and 300 for the Compact. Well, that's the Core X LED light fixture from Aquatic Life and HM Electronics. It's a perfect match if you're utilizing the Aquatic Life hybrid, the perfect marriage between T5s and LEDs. And it's overall a really solid light. So far, I'm loving it in the few months that I've had it set up on the 210 gallon reef. The corals seem to be happy out and open and they're loving it too, so I'm excited to add more corals to the reef tank in later videos. Now, if you like the content here on the Coral Reef Talk, please consider hitting that subscribe button so you can follow the rest of the Reef Tank Rebirth series. Click the bell icon to be notified every time I upload new videos. Happy reefing everyone, and I'll see you next time on the Coral Reef Talk.